Continuing on with our panel of experts, you know, Tom, in the video, it mentioned that cows contaminate the pasture more than calves. Can you speak to that, please? Sure. Cows are the contaminator of the pastures. If you think about turning the cow-calf pair out on the pasture in the spring, the calf is depending on the cow's milk for its nutrition at that stage of its life, but the cow is depending on the pasture for, for her nutrition. So she sets about grazing up the grass and remember those infective larvae that came out of the ground and are now in the grass ready to be infect the cow. She picks those up, they mature to adults, start laying eggs, thousands of eggs, which then go out in the manure. After a few turns of those, that cycle, you can imagine that there's a huge buildup of infective larvae on the pasture just about the time that the calves start grazing. Tony, what are some of the other benefits of treating that cow? Well, when you treat a cow with long range, instead of cleaning her up in the fall, you keep her clean through the grazing season. And what you see from the benefits of that is improved body condition, which lends itself to better improved uh, reproductive efficiency. So she tends to cycle sooner, settle faster as a result with improved body condition. You know, what about you, Justin? How has long range helped to improve your profitability? In our line of work, we have to really consider all avenues. And, and what I have started to see is that the cows are more content. The cows are, are happier longer. And, and whenever you're delivering feed, every time you drive that tractor, it just costs you money. So we are, we are starting to deliver a little bit less feed. They are more efficient. And what we're, what we're seeing then is that the cow, is, as she's more efficient, then the calf becomes more efficient, and we wean bigger calves. All right, thanks a lot, gentlemen. Stay with us. We'll have more of NCBA's Cattleman to Cattleman right after this.